The interior design of this house is one where we want something that's very unique, upscale, contemporary, but not super minimal. The location of the house is amazing, very convenient to the rest of Lower Mainland, but also Confederation Park is at your back door. I'm Eric Lee and I'm the design director and owner of Victoria Premium Homes. We were involved with this house because our client brought us in. He wanted a really high-end design, high-quality build. And at the time, this house was actually one of the most expensive in North Burnaby. On the main floor, it's an open plan, and it's definitely focused towards the wow effect. With the tall ceiling and the beautiful pendants that come down, and that walnut wood panel that brings your eyes all the way up 20 feet, there's a lot of competition behind that, and there's a lot of money behind that to get it to that level. This house actually won three awards with both Haven and Ovation. The awards are Best Any Room, Whole Home, which is the, the entire home, and then Best Interior Design. Time to go to the favorite part of the house. Let's go to the kitchen. You can tell us about that amazing island and the dining area. Yeah, for sure. The, we spent a lot of time designing and building this beautiful island. As you can see, it's, it's a sculptural masterpiece. The rounded corners, the floating look, all of that is very hard to execute. There wasn't too many fabricators that can make this for us, but we worked very closely with them to execute this floating vision that we had of the island. The rest of the kitchen is the walnut bringing in the wood panels, Sub-Zero Mila package, top notch, everything that you would ever want, a European look, and of course the open design towards the dining room. And then behind the kitchen is a mud room, lots of storage, and a pantry. So although this kitchen is kept as a minimal look, you have lots of storage at the back. Eric, can you please tell us about the design of uh, the lower floor, the basement? For sure, the basement is designed with one purpose in mind, and that's entertaining. This is where it all happens. You've got the curved large screen TV with a projector screen also in front of it, so you get to choose which medium you want to watch on. Let's go to the bar and it can tell us about the design behind the bar. For sure. The bar itself here is an amazing piece of design and craftsmanship. It's back painted blue glass inspired by the blue cap of the Grey Goose, but we also wanted to continue that high-tech, very cyber type of feel with a fractal design. And if you can see here, we actually highlight it with an LED light so that the shapes will really come out and really be alive. Towards the rest of the house, it's an open plan. Toughest part of an open plan is how do you define a space without walls? We want it to be something substantial, so a very large ribbon fireplace instead of a divider becomes a focal piece of the entire main floor. Also some other very cool design effects that you would not get anywhere else. If you look at the ceiling, the knife edge detail that we have, but with the LED around. It's very high-tech, very spaceship-like, and that's one of the themes of this whole house, is this very high-tech, beautifully designed, minimalistic, modern home. The exterior is, again, for lifestyle. You look at the hot tub, the fire pit, beautifully landscaped, planter seating area, that's all thought through. There's even an outdoor TV that you can watch. Also, if you look up at the soffit, what you'll see is that there's actually a motorized awning that comes out and extends to really extend that covered patio space for those shoulder seasons. The master bedroom itself, everything is custom designed from the headboard, even the side night tables with the stone countertop. And we designed that because we knew that there wasn't a large floor space that we can work with. So if everything is custom designed in its place, you actually get a lot of that functionality in a small space. 